The Linear Z-Wave Garage Door Control for Nexia offers remote garage door operation, scheduled opening and closing, status monitoring, and customized alerts. Please note this control works with sectional garage doors and with garage door openers compatible with simple push-button controls. It is not compatible with openers using proprietary communications. Before you begin, please ensure the following items are available. The contents of your garage door control, basic tools, your Nexia bridge, a sturdy ladder, and an available outlet near your existing garage door opener. You should remove power from the garage door opener to prevent any unexpected door movement. You will start by installing the tilt sensor. Using screws or double-sided tape, secure the sensor base near the top of the garage door, ensuring the arrow is pointed up. Activate the sensor by removing the battery protection strip. Snap the sensor onto the base with arrow pointing up. Next, include the garage door control into Nexia. Power the device near your Nexia bridge. Open the Nexia mobile app. Scroll down to tap Connect New Device, then tap Z-Wave Device, and then Next. Now, press the Link button on the garage control. During inclusion, a progress bar is displayed on the app, indicating communication between the bridge and the control. When the inclusion process is complete, the control will beep three times and the app will display a success message. The garage door icon will now be shown on the app. Next, mount the garage door control near your existing opener. Use the bracket shown here to install the control to your existing hardware. Optionally, you could use the supplied drywall screws and anchors. If using the bracket, mount this assembly to the existing hardware with two bolts and nuts. Connect the two white wires to the same terminals used for existing push buttons. You can connect either wire to either terminal. Plug in the control's power supply. An included retaining bracket holds the plug securely. Connect power to the device. The control will flash and beep. Neatly secure all excess wire away from moving parts using the wire ties. Safely reconnect power to your garage door opener. And finally, use your existing push button to operate the door one time. This will synchronize the door position with your Nexia account. You can now use your Nexia portal or mobile app to control your garage door. Click the garage door icon and tap open or close. The control will signal that the door is about to move. Explore the Nexia portal to maximize your system. Click the Edit Settings button for custom garage door alerts. And use automations for security and convenience, such as scheduling your garage door to close daily at sunset. For additional support, please view our help content at mynexia.com, visit our Nexia subscriber forum, or contact our customer service team. Thank you.